She was awesome. I just wanted to say that. So today, um, I got a surprise for you. I am going to, I've been asked to talk today. I'm not sure why they didn't give me this topic, but I am going to talk for the next 15 or 16 minutes on how to manufacture a mutual fund. <laughs> so if you can just hang on to your bootstraps, this is going to be exciting. Now, in all seriousness, uh, I got a few minutes to spend with you. And, uh, I, I just want to say that I'm, I'm, I'm honored, I'm humbled, um, and I'm honored to be on this stage and to spend a few minutes with you. Uh, I don't take any of that for granted. You know, 19 years ago is when Colette and I started the business. And um, I remember sitting up there, we've heard that before, and it was just her and I. That was it. And I remember sitting down and going, this will be, this is the first time, and this will be the last time that we're here by ourselves. And here we are only 19 years later, and we have uh, just short of 6,000 people here on our team and our hierarchy. So let's hear it for Canada for one second. Uh, I, I, like I say, I don't have a lot of time. So what I want to talk is I have, a, I have a couple of messages for all of you, especially those of you that have been here for the, that are here for the very first time. Uh, maybe second time, maybe even third time, or even many of you who have been here for quite a while and are just not where you want to be. I just want to tell you that, and you've heard that before many times today, is that this is by far, by far, the best business opportunity that you will ever, ever, ever come across in your entire lifetime. That's WFG. Yes, absolutely. WFG deserves. Listen, we got everything we need. We've got we got the best of the best when it comes to manufacturers and products. We've got, you know, uh, we, we've got, we, we heard from Dave Paulson today, and, and we got Joe and his entire team at home office. We've got the founders of the company that are still, it, it is, you know, they're still with us and helping us. We've got great leadership throughout North America. Uh, there's a huge need for what we do. And there's an awful lot of people out there, and it, come, it seems to come in, in, in waves. There's all kinds of people that are trying to, you know, they, they, they try and duplicate WFG. Let me tell you something. I'm not saying that it can't be duplicated, but anybody out there who is trying to duplicate WFG, they are so far behind that they are actually delusional us, that, that they actually think they're ahead of who or where we are. You can't replace Bonnie Home and Rich Lawley and Jack Linder and Swan Wynn. You can't replace those people overnight. There are a lot of great people outside of WFG, but these men have been working for a long, long time to get us to where we are, them and their spouses. So my point to all this is, and you've heard this many times today, is you gotta seal your mind. This is the best opportunity. There's nothing else out there, nothing. I'm 66 years old, I've tried all kinds of things, and there is nothing that comes close. And if you wanna succeed, if you wanna to get to the promised land, for lack of a better word, you're gonna to have to seal your mind, plant your flag, and this is it. I, you know, Claudette and I, I did lots of things in, in, in my previous career, and I was relatively successful in a couple of them. But the reason that I was never super successful as I, I wasn't in the right vehicle to begin with, and I kept chasing other stuff. And when we came to WFG at 46 years old, I said, this is it. Nothing, nothing else am I going to look at, and as a result of that, here's where we are today. So, do yourself a favor, okay? Don't blow this opportunity. There's a lot of you that are going to leave here, and some person's going to come along and say, hey, come and look at our deal. Our deal is better for whatever reason. They are full of BS. Nothing is better than WFG. And I'm going to put you to the test right now. 
I don't put you in a test that next time somebody comes along and says anything back bad about WOG, you and I, I'm not sure if I'll get in trouble here or not, but I really don't care, like John Chen said. The next time somebody says anything bad about WOG, you have my permission to pop in the nose. I'll tell you what, I'm sure glad we sealed our mind uh, 19 years ago. I'm sure glad we made the decisions that we did because we are living a great life today. Listen, there's going to be a lot of things you're going to have to do in order to be successful. There's the obvious. You're going to have to work hard. You're going to have to commit. You're going to have to focus. You're going to have to make sacrifices and much, much, much more. You're going to have to do all those things. But if there's one thing that I, that I hope you take home with you, is your, the, to me, the biggest, biggest thing that you're going to have to work on is you got to figure out why you want to do the business. This is not a complicated business, but it's also not an easy one. Matter of fact, being an entrepreneur is really not that easy, but it's sure worth it. So I don't care what you do. I don't care how many books you got to read. I don't care how many tapes you're going to listen to. There's all kinds of help out there to help you figure out why you want to do the business. And if you haven't got that figured out, and, and by the way, that's going to change as you get older, as your life changes, as you get married, as you have kids, grandkids, all that's going to change. It's not just a, I'm going to think about it for one hour, I'm going to have 10 goals or a bucket list and then my life is up. No, this is something that evolves. It changes with time. So you need to work on that. It's something you need to work on all the time. I'm going to share with you what our why is, what my why is. And it's pretty simple. We have lots of goals, lots of dreams, but you know, many years ago, uh, I made some very, very poor financial decisions. And as a result of that, I put my family in harm's way financially. And for three or four years, I struggled. I struggled about the mistakes that I'd made. I struggled about a whole bunch of things. And then fortunately, a friend of mine who's in this room today, him and I had a meeting, we had a coffee, and. I tried to recruit him to some MLM deal where I made $9 in 18 months and he said he was interested but he wanted to talk to me about something which happened to be WMG. And as a result of that, our life has changed. But we were flat broke at 46 years old. Didn't have two nickels to rub together. Five kids, very worried. For the first time in my life, I, I, I had lost uh, confidence in myself. Um, I, I just, I was, not, I was a broken man. And then WMG comes along. So my why, like I said, we have many goals, many dreams, but here's my why. Bear with me for a second. I'll share this with you. I've shared it with some of you before. See, my biggest why is this. I never, 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 ever, never, ever, ever, never, ever, ever, never, get the point? Ever want to be broke again. I never want to be broke again. And that is my biggest why. That is that is my biggest why. That's what. That's what, that's what I fight for, and that's what I would die for. It's not, about, it's not about the money, it's about the, life, the type of life you can, you can have and you can experience if you're not broke. So for those of you that are not where you want to be financially, okay, and you're struggling, and said, hey, we've been, we, most of us have been there. But boy, WMG is the place, it is the, it is the place where you can literally change your life forever. You know, we've done things like, you know, we've, we've managed to help Claudette's mom. We bought her a house two years ago. She's been living there now already for 10 years, I think. And she's just been able to enjoy her retirement, uh, living in her own home, brand new home, lives uh, near a golf course, we're close to her, a couple of her brothers. You know, we had a, we had a granddaughter, which she was born eight years ago, I think. Something like that. I, I don't even know my, when my birthday is, so don't try to get me to remember my grandkid's birthday. But I think she's about eight years old. She was one pound, seven ounces when, uh, when she was born. We didn't think she was gonna go beyond two or three days. Today, she, she's a rambunctious, typical eight-year-old. You'd never know she was one pound, seven ounces. And we had a hand in helping, making sure that, that, that she was given the best care when she was in the most need. We've done all kinds of things. We've done all, all kinds of fun things. I mean, our life is, our life is pretty darn good today. It can always get better. Uh, we always have things to learn. But I just wanna share a quick story with you. Uh, just two weeks ago, um, Claudette and I took our entire family, uh, her and I, five married kids, that's 12 adults, and 17 grandkids, 
to model. The cool thing about that is none of my kids paid one red cent. I wouldn't even let them buy me a cocktail. We bought everything. We paid for everybody's flight. We, um, we paid for all their accommodations. They had a real nice two bedroom condos, so they all had their own space. Uh, spent a fortune on food. Uh, we um, went out to some nice dinners. I rented a, a catamaran just for us. Imagine spending five hours in the middle of the ocean. We have pictures of our grandkids smo smoking. <laughs> I don't know, maybe that too. <laughs> Swimming. <laughs> With wild dolphins and, and turtles. It, it was just amazing. But for me, and I'm sure for Claudette, it was able to just sit back and just watch. We were able to watch our kids, um, you know, have fun together, play together. Um, they were, you know, imagine, I mean, the whole, the resort knew that the Michaud family was there. We took it over, but they were polite. And uh, they, they, they just had fun, they respected all kinds of people. That just says, that just speaks volumes to uh, our kids and how they're raising their families and all that kind of stuff. You see, I like, I, I, you know, there's certain things that people like that turns them on, and that's okay. There's some people who get turned on by fancy cars and, you know, 13 million square foot houses and all that kind of stuff. That don't mean crap to me. What means crap to me is to see my kids, uh, you know, thank you. You know, I haven't shared this with anybody, but I just realized that he put it on Instagram, so obviously I'm not the only one who saw this message. <laughs> so I saw this on Instagram the other day. I don't even know what the hell Instagram is. I don't know how I found this. <laughs> but here's what our, my, my uh, oldest grandson, 14 years old, put on Instagram. He says, had a great time with the cousins in Maui, Hawaii. I love them all so much, and I'm blessed to have them all as cousins. There is no way this trip could have gotten better. We also rented a private catamaran. Here's where it gets tough for me. But here's where this is worth all the cars and all the houses and all the rings and all the jewelry in the world. You can't, you couldn't give me enough of that stuff, but you can give me a lot of this stuff. Here's what he says. He says, uh, thanks to Riel Michel, the world's best grandpa, and Claudette, uh, the world's best cook and grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I, I hope I have this opportunity again to do this again. This was one of a kind trip and it was fun. I mean, what's funner than hanging out with 17 cousins that are very much, uh, uh, that are very cool, uh, that are very cool. I love my cousins very much, and my aunties and my uncles. Can't put a price on that. <laughs> couldn't have experienced that. Couldn't have done that if I wouldn't have taken WG seriously 19 years ago. I want you to remember one thing. I, I, uh, I've been working on something lately, and it's helping me. We're all human beings. We all have good times, we all have bad times. We all go in the tank once in a while. I just want you to remember one thing. What's really helping me is every time that I go into the tank, every time I'm starting to feel crappy, every time I, 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 every time I, I want to start making excuses about stuff or blaming people for whatever, I now go to a happy place. And my happy place is just to stop for a minute and be thankful for everything that we have. And you know what? No matter where you are in this business right now, you all have something to be thankful about. One thing for sure, every day that we wake up, we need to be thankful that we're at least our, that we're above ground that day. So remember to be thankful. My wish for you is this, and many people have talked about it today. Gosh sakes, make a decision today. Not tomorrow, not when you get home. We all, all have the same opportunity, all of us. The, you know, people meet us out there. 
Uh, the, the world is a mess, but we have answers to a lot of, we have answers and solutions to a lot of challenges that people have. And most of the challenges people have is money, and it's not because they have too much of it. So we have an opportunity to go and help people, whether it's, whether it's just getting them as a client, or of course, more importantly, we have this great opportunity called WFG. Make a decision, go for it. I mean, what's holding you back? I hope that you leave here and you've had a breakthrough. Whether you've already had one, or maybe it's tomorrow, or maybe it's on the way home, okay? But here's what you need to do it for. You don't need to do this for Joe DePaula, or WMG, or Transamerica, or anybody else. But you need to do this for you, for you. And then if you do it for you, do it also for your family. You have a chance to leave a legacy behind. You have a chance to become very, very, to become someone that's very special, okay? And it doesn't exist anywhere else. Somebody invited you to a BPM, somebody did a one-on-one -on -one once upon a time with you, you signed an AMA, don't blow this opportunity. It's just too great of an opportunity. Yes, we're gonna have challenges. Yes, it doesn't always go with the way we wanna go, but by golly, there's nothing, nothing else. So please, please, when you go home, or later tonight, or tomorrow, just go, you know what, this is it, I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. I am changing the destiny of my life and my family's life forever. Other people have done it, why not me? I deserve it, my family deserves it. That's all I hope for all of you. Thank you very much.